Thank you. Um, here at uh, Little Grindstone, um, Mike Eastman, I live out here. Um, today's lift was pretty poor, uh, lots of uh, green algae. On the bigger pellets, we uh, I don't didn't catch any big fish because there's not much around. We all just snap these bones out there on the big ones. And it's bone, I say, right through the pellet. Little Grindstone Harbor. We're just on the outside here, cruising around. Hecla Islands uh, to the east of us here, and Big Grindstone straight north. It's where the Susan E went down. Yeah, bless their souls, all them. Terrible day. So we're coming to the entrance of the Little Grindstone Harbor here. We have on our five-year plan um, this breakwater. We were, we'd like to uh, get it moved out and brought it to S turn here so we get get a few more berths in here. We're coming up on it, and it's the one the breakwater to the left. Grindstone's a beautiful place to live. There's about 450 cottages here, including a store. Another thing that uh, we really need is uh, the cell tower. Um, MTS has a tower here, but we can't get cell service here. It's uh, for emergencies and for even for parks, uh, fire, uh, fires, and um, plus for boulders in distress. We have 48 stalls here, berthing, uh, 15 fishermen in spring, I mean 15 in the fall. Depends where the fish is and we have heavy dirt here, the guys will take off the salt. It's a good little well protected harbor here. I'd like to thank Smallcraft Harbors for all the New per are the new um, permanent dock here, all steel sheet pylons here. That was put in a few years ago. We have three conveyors here. And we're waiting for one more loading dock to uh, come back here and uh, we'll put the other conveyor on that one. These ones are both electric here. Uh, commercial fishermen here pay uh, for two seasons, uh, $50 for the spring, $50 for the fall. And then you can see our boating fees for the, the recreational boaters here. Goes by footage and the season, $230 for zero to 22 footers and 23 footers and over $300. Uh, another thing we did here this spring was re replacing the rails on the docks. Um, they were rotten and that, and um, so we replaced them and we put bumpers on. This will protect um, the rails way better. So your boat comes in and we put like this, everything's holding better. Good. This loading dock was uh, brought in last year. Uh, it's a wider one, longer one. And built this at my place here, this conveyor. And we did a few more modifications on it. She runs perfect. And 
And this conveyor here was built by Thor Eldson Riverton. This one's a very good conveyor. This These are LD lighting. Um, it was done with, uh, well, the dock was done here. They put the posts in and got it powered on here, and it's uh, very good lighting here. We have fire extinguishers here. There's two of them, um, certified every year in case there's a fire here in the boat, boats or anything. So I think you guys can grab them.